This video intended for entertainment and informative purposes only, but the live commentary may not reflect this rating. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's that buried treasure, by the way. And, uh, ooh, diamond. And since, uh, we have the looter mod installed, anyone who finds this can get their own loot inside. Hey, everybody, it's Clonaclux999, and I am joined by Glorious King Gabe and Voidway, who, just like Vampire Garabat, has a different skin that he uses sometimes. Except the, the skin that Vampire Garabat, uh, currently uses is his, uh, default now. Okay. okay. Anyways, welcome back to more Minecraft 1.19.2 Cloning Community Nether 16. And this is the obligatory update video where its entire purpose is to show the footage of me digging my trash pit and my mine. But, but before we do, but before we do that, I want to at least show a little bit of something, and that something is that we is that. We are going to make a flamerang for Voidway. Hand me that ancient debris, please. Aye, aye. There. Thank you. What Man, that was very fitting. Oh yeah, you were holding. <laughs> you were holding that goat horn. So, um, start. So before we do that, we need to blast this. So I'm going to uh, stick this in the blackstone furnace. Do I actually have the gold for this? Though? Okay, yes, I have four gold ingots. I got enough gold for it as well. So. Okay, and. Uh, what are those sound effects on, on the other end? Are you eating something, Gabe? Yeah, I was eating something. Sorry, I forgot to mute. G give me some. You, you should share. Sharing is caring. Okay. You know what they said right. in school? How you should you should always have enough for the whole class. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that. I you know I remember once uh, I actually um, I remember once I actually uh, started chewing gum in class uh, and I knew my teacher would be like. Be like, um, uh, uh, Caleb, shouldn't you be? No, should you be chewing gum in class? And I said, uh, d no, don't worry, I have enough for the rest of the class. And I was about ready to share it with everyone, and then, well, it didn't really work. Okay. Oh, damn. So one thing I'm going to remind you guys of, uh, boy, you might want to put your gold helmet on if you're going to come outside. Is that um, be fun. is that is regarding uh crops and like growing stuff. Here in the Nether, because as you know, you cannot place water you place water in the Nether because it just evaporates. Well, I'm just going to remind you guys that um, I will allow us to use commands to um, place water in the Nether, only for the purpose of growing crops or or um, assisting a build, not for traversing in the Nether. So if I do this, we now have water. Okay. We like water. Yes. And it's nice and it's nice and refreshing in the in the hot nether. Yes. We also need to make it sure is. we like don't die. Uh yeah, that's why I built that's why I built this 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 is the my house so far uh, that I built out of polished blackstone bricks. Okay. So, now um n now uh that netherite scrap should be done and I can use, um, put it in the workbench, and four gold ingots to make a single netherite ingot. Void wait, hand me that picker ring, please. Don't do it, he's gonna kill you. No. Oh, wow, it's I'll already, it's already, like, really losing durability. How do you repair it? I use it. Uh, I'm assuming with mending or using another picker ring. Um, do I have a mending book on, on me, actually? I think I have a piercing one. Depth Strider, Sweeping Edge, Bane of Breath, Pots, Fire, Aspect, Looting, Allure, uh, no, no mending, so, uh, it's just kind of like this. So. It's fine, I can always get a new picker in. Alright. Actually, should we just, do you have another heart, of, heart, uh, diamond heart? Currently, I no, but they're easy to get now that I have something that does enough damage to kill a stoneling in one hit. Because I'm kind of wondering, should we save this netherite, netherite ingot, or should we just put it on this one? Shall we save it? We can if you would like. I mean, it would be a little bit tedious to go out and fight another stoneling, unless you want, unless you want a cut footed jump. I can go do that now if you want, or we can save the ingot. Uh, okay. Or something. Uh, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna stop the recording. Let's go do that real quick. While we're waiting for Void to get his diamond heart, I'd like to actually show another mod that we added. Um, it is called Mob Catcher, and it's basically what you think it is. We got this green Pokeball, or Mob Ball as I like to call it. No, I will not call it a Mob Catcher device. 
and you simply make it out of an ender pearl and four iron. So, let me go ahead. Check it out, it's a giant green Pokeball. And the mob catch mobs. Yep. The point of the mob catcher mob mod is to catch mobs in the ball and then transport them elsewhere. It's an easy and convenient way of transporting mobs that might be a hassle to, to that might be a hassle to get oh to uh, get to a different place. Kinda wondering how much I want to use it though, so I guess I'll find out. Okie dokie, Voidway now has a, a brand new Pickerang. Let me see it. Here you are. Alright. So, um, here's the netherite ingot. Moment of silence. And there we go. We have a, we now have a Flamerang. Um, we, we actually went back into the, uh, the, um, the, uh, Bastion Remnant just before we, um, just before we, uh, started the recording to, uh, see what, it, to, uh, get, uh, four more ancient debris. And we did find some, uh, the Looter Mod helped with that. Just before I give it to Voidway, I'd like to, I would like to actually... What happened? A, uh, little dog came through the window and bit me. Ow, okay. But just before we, uh... And test uh, give it back to you. I want to actually test it out. I'm going to assume that it sets mobs on fire and it also auto smelts. Let's try it. Be awesome. No, it doesn't auto smelt. Somehow, pick a ring returned. No, I it guess. doesn't. It doesn't auto smelt. Although maybe it doesn't in iron. Nope. So hmm. let's see. Uh, is there a piglin around I can test this on? Uh, there's a lot of zombified ones. Uh, there's one in this direction. Uh, Test it on Hoglin. I, there, are are no there are no Hoglins around here, so I'll just go to this this uh, pickling that just happens to be uh, walking around here. Also, where is this cobble deep slate coming from? I don't know. Oh, you've been throwing it. And I thought there was one over here. Oh, maybe it might be up here. Careful, uh, careful, ghasts. If you hear a gas, take cover. Ah, uh, great. And apparently there wasn't one over here. Let's go a different way. Actually, wait. I have a better. Idea. No, that's not gonna work. Just throw it at Gabe. I don't want to. I don't want to test it on the other players. Right. Test it on him. He's been killing everybody. <laughs> no, I guess, I've only been killing you. I guess he does kind of deserve it, but I'm not going to do it. But add it to me, and I'll do it. I want. I could probably test it on an Enderman, but I don't know an Ender, if an Enderman is gonna, gonna just teleport away. Oh, it'll teleport. There's actually. Oh wait, there's a Crimson Forest over here. We can do it. In. Crimson. Okay. Uh, yeah, just on a hoglin. That's a. I think that's a good. Yeah, hoglins test subject. Nice. Yeah, hoglins are not immune to fire, so I'll just one the first piglin or hoglin that I see, I'll test it on. Careful on that soul sand, by the way. I do have some uh, soul compost, soul compost going as well, so I can uh, get the uh, really the fungi colonies and such. Um, Sweet. I can't get anywhere. Oh, there we go. We went up here. Parkour. Oh, you can just go around, but yeah, I'm just. I actually tried parkouring over this earlier, and I failed miserably. <laughs> oh, I forgot to put gold on. Oh yeah. Well, oh, here's I our. About put that. Well, here's our test subject. I'm gonna wait till both of you guys are here. No, 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 no! Wait, wait, wait. No. Ah, yep, I died in lava. Oh, I put my helmet on. Okay. Here's our first test test subject. You ready? Mhm. Mm okay. All right, and do oh, I missed? Do I? I hit you. Ah, oh, come on! It didn't set it on set it on fire. I'm a tad bit confused. Well, what does the flamer flamer ring do? Okay, let me go to information. Works like, a picker, fire, like... works like a picker. Works like a but any items it picks up become immune to fire and lava damage while they trap. Oh, that's actually useful. That's it, though. I mean, it would be useful if we didn't have item physics, but well, then again, I guess that is useful because it is entirely possible that something could pass through fire. But I don't next, know. I, I'm I'm next, a little. 
I am honestly a little bit disappointed. And it's got 1,040 durability. All right, Void, yeah. here's your pick. Here's your pick ring. Right? And next time you're in the overworld, we will see what an Echo Rang is like. I would very much like to, thank you. Yeah. Now, the other thing I'd like to do is I'm going to warp to Fortress 1. So, if and so if you guys get here without crashing, then uh, I'm going to get out of the way. There's blazes. Okay, you're both. Oh here. God. Okay. Um, I want to go into the warped forest that's over here. Okay. Uh, down here. Oh. Or just ah. one. So I, as you know, as you know, we do have one of the. Uh, oh, come on, game. Game. Huh? Oh, oh, coming. As you know, we do have um, the uh, farmer's um, delight. Er, just, just crawl through. Okay. Just crawl, just crawl through, mate. Oh, I see it. Yeah, there you go. Well, as you know, careful with the Enderman. We do have a uh, farmer's delight add-ons installed, and um, I did a little bit of looking in this um, in this warp forest, and I found pomegranates. No, 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 pomegranates. Uh -huh. If you pick them, you will get a little prick, but um, you will get pomegranates. And just one of these babies will give you eight seeds. But pick them from the top, because if you pick them from the bottom, you're just gonna get um, you're just gonna get um, one seed. Uh, Gabe, how about you have a try at it? There you go. Ah, okay. Dicks. You got some pomegranates. Um, if you if you pick them with shears, however, um, you won't get a prick. Let's see. Any more bushes? And you took. Oh. I wish you told me that earlier, because I have some shears on me. Oh, sorry. Uh, Void, there's a, there's a bush over here. Why don't you try it? Oh, no. uh, Wait, I can't uh, eat these? I was, just, I, was just about, I was just about to right-click at the try to eat, and apparently you can't eat it. You oh. can eat the seeds themselves, just like in real life. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Not gonna lie, I do not like... And it gives you vol volatility for a few seconds. Yeah. I've never. I wonder what that means. I wonder what the death message is for dying from being pricked by a pomegranate bush. Let's um, find out. <laughs> I've never actually eaten a. Well, it's gonna. They take a long time to grow, so I wouldn't really. Yeah, never mind. Worry no. about that. Um, and they kind of a hassle to eat in real life. I've never had one in real life before. Yeah, I've only had pomegranate juice, and I don't like pomegranate juice. Okay, I'm gonna turn these into seeds. Can you actually? Um, can you actually plant them another egg? No, you can't. You have to plant them on like some kind of dirt block or grass block or whatever. But uh, that's all I really wanted to show for this video. Do you guys have anything you want to show? Nope. Nope. All right. So um, and so I guess I'm work. I'm going to um, so so I'm going to us end the the main part of the video here, and the rest of the video will be me digging my trash pit and my mine. So uh, next. Next time on Clone Community Nether 16, what can we do? Because there's not a whole, whole lot we can do other than take on fortresses and bastion remnants. So that's what. So, so so whatever it is, we'll do next time. So see you guys then. And reflecting the Nether 15 series, cue the music. Oh yes, and from the from those enchanted books that I got from uh from uh that lucky those lucky potions, I put fortune in three and unbreaking three in my diamond pickaxe and looting three and sharpness two on my diamond knife.